Life is short. We do not have time for bad vibes. Hello, spooky babes, and welcome back to Scaratonin, or welcome if you're new here. My name is Taylor, and on this channel, we embrace cozy, spooky magic all year long. If you are a returning subscriber, as always, thank you so much for being here. I love you all so much. I am so thankful for you. And if you're new here and you find that you're enjoying the type of content I'm putting out, it would mean so much if you could hit that subscribe button. I put out a couple videos every single week, and they always have to do with all things spooky, cozy, autumn, Salem, witchy, and just spooky goodness all year long. Please excuse that my neck is red. I scratched it, and it's going to stay red for a while, so ignore we're talking about the good stuff today. I am so excited because I'm finally bringing you my Salem haul. If you follow me on Instagram or you read my updates on my channel, I ended up getting very sick the week that I was supposed to go to Salem. It's a long story. I talk about it a little bit more in my next coffee video that's coming out. So stay tuned for that if you want to hear that whole story, but I'm not going to bore you with that. We're going to get right into the good stuff today. So even though I couldn't go to Salem, I wanted to support all these amazing businesses there. So I decided to go online and order some things that I had my eyes on so that I could still feel the Salem goodness even while I was at home. All of these businesses are amazing. They shipped out so fast. They got here in less than a week and everything is absolutely beautiful and incredible. And it just makes me feel so good to have these little bits of Salem around me at all times, even though I couldn't make it this year. I am planning a summer trip, hopefully in August, so stay tuned for that. I'm making it happen. I am getting to Salem at least once this year, and nothing is gonna stop me the next time. Now, all of these items you'll be able to get online. I will link the shops that I got them from, and again, they shipped super quickly, and everything arrived perfectly, nothing was damaged, and I'm so pleased with everything that I ordered. I couldn't be happier, and I'm so excited to show you. So, the first thing I got is this tea that is from Coven Dark Boutique. If I'm going to have a hot drink, I want to have tea. I don't really like hot coffee as you may have seen in my other coffee videos. I just started dabbling with coffee. I really enjoy iced coffee much more, but I am a tea drinker through and through. I have two giant boxes filled with tea and I can never get enough. So when I saw this tea on Coven, I was really intrigued because I've never heard of a tea like this before. So this is the belated tea from Morbid Curiosity, which is really cute, Curiosity, T-E-A, little play on words there. And it has the cutest little birthday ghosty. So I'm assuming this is, you know, you could give this to someone for a birthday or something like that, but I was so curious about the flavor. I'm not giving this to anyone. My birthday's not till October. I needed to try this. So it's so cute, it says it's never too late to celebrate, and then it gives you a little bit about the taste. So it's sweet and thoughtful, super cute. I'm not even gonna try to say this. It's the Oolong Rooibos Chai. I, I know I'm butchering that, but that is the type of tea. And it has vanilla, coconut, orange, ginger, cinnamon cloves, cardamom, and candy sprinkles. So what really got me was the candy sprinkles because I have never had a tea with any kind of candy in it at all. So I was really excited to try this. I ordered the larger bag. It retails for about $22, I believe. And it got here super quickly. Again, it comes in just the cutest packaging. It has a resealable zip closure so that you can open and close it again and again. And look, you can even see the colored candy sprinkles in there, which is so cool. So since this is a loose leaf tea, I ordered some of these tea filters just off of Amazon to go with it. I think that these are much better than a tea ball. I know that tea balls don't always close all the way or little tea leaves can leak out. So these filters are just like a tea bag. Nothing is getting out and they're very big. So you can put as much or as little of the loose leaf tea as you want. So if you do end up getting a loose leaf tea from them and they have so many different flavors, I will definitely be trying more. I would recommend getting these to go with it. I was able to get these overnight on Amazon for just a couple dollars. So I had this tea this morning while I was getting ready for work and it is so delicious. To me, it just tastes like a regular chai tea with a little bit of sweetness. So I like that little extra hint from the candy sprinkles. I think that is such a unique and cool touch. And I just love the colors. Again, it's such a pretty tea. I've never seen a tea like that. 
And the bag is pretty big, so this will last me for a long time. Like I said, I'm definitely gonna be ordering more flavors from them in the future. And yeah, I was really impressed with this. I was really happy with this order. And if you're a tea drinker, check out Coven for some tea. They also included a cute little Coven sticker, which I've just put on my board over on the wall here with all my other spooky stuff. And so I love when businesses add special little touches like that, like little stickers or little cards. So love that, love Coven, check them out. Next up are some items that I keep in my house to help me feel uplifted and to cleanse the house and to bring good energy to my home. So I have yet to actually go into Hex, but I know a lot of people love it. They have so much online, so many ritual tools from room sprays to sage to spell jars. They have all kinds of ritual items. So whatever you're looking for, you'll definitely be able to find it on Heck. I ordered a gigantic bundle of sage. I was not expecting it to be this big. So this was exciting when it got here. This is the cedar and sage bundle. I have yet to burn it. I have yet to use it for cleansing. I do have a couple other bundles of sage in my house that I have used, but I'm excited to finally have sage from Salem. That is the one thing I regretted not getting on my last trip because I feel like when you know where your items are coming from and if they're coming from Salem, they're, you know, they're good. They're made with good intentions. And so this smells good. You can really smell the cedar. I love the smell of cedar wood. I grew up with a dad who was a builder. Anytime we had extra cedar wood, we would burn it in our fire pit and it smells amazing when it burns. So I'm very excited to burn this. I'll probably cleanse my house this week. So if I remember, I'll include a little clip of that as well. But that is a hefty, hefty bundle. And like I said, it got here quick. They shipped really fast. And I know sometimes with sage, it can kind of fall apart. It was mostly intact, so that's great. And I'm really pleased with this. If you're looking for something like Sage or Palo Santo, I would definitely recommend looking at a place like Hex. You know where it's coming from. You know you're going to be getting a good product. So check them out. And then this was something else that I was really interested in from Hex. They have a lot of different room sprays for whatever your need might be. So I ordered the Protection Room Spray. Just looks like this, a little amber colored glass bottle. And like I said, I like to have positive energy in my home. I wanna make sure that Anyone that's coming into my home is bringing good energy and good intentions. So I like having this in my house just to protect our space and make sure that only good vibes are coming through the door. It also says on the back that you can use this in place of incense. So if you're not comfortable burning incense, you can use this. It's not smoky, it's not as strong, and you can use it on things like drapes, sheets, and clothes. So if you're going out and about and you want a little extra protection, you can use this on your clothing. On the back, it says, throughout history, potions and perfumes have been used to ward off evil and harm to promote good energy. Spray to cast a word of protection over you, your home, your loved ones, and even your car. So with this spray, we're creating a shield of good energy all around us, which we love. We are here for those vibes. We don't have time for bad vibes. Life is short. We do not have time for bad vibes. So the smell is definitely a little bit woodsy to me. I mean, it definitely smells a little bit like incense, but it's not overpowering. I think it's a really nice light scent. I've sprayed it in my house already. It's definitely not overwhelming. It's just a nice light scent that makes you feel good and reminds you that you're surrounded by good energy. You're protected in your space and only good vibes are coming through that door. Okay, so next up is something that I was so excited about. I ordered this cast iron cauldron from Coven's Cottage. It is so cute. It is hefty. It is completely cast iron. It has a little metal handle. It has the three little pegs on the bottom. So it's definitely a cauldron. Now I've seen some people keep their sage in these. It is six inches, so it is pretty large. When I saw this, I knew that I had to have it because like I said, I like my home to feel witchy and magical all year long and it does not get more witchy than a beautiful black cauldron. I'm telling you, you guys, this is so beautifully made. So beautifully made. I'm really impressed with the quality of it. And I decided to add this purple plant, which I can't remember off the top of my head what the name is. I gotta go back and look at the tag and I will insert the name of it. I got it from Lowe's and it is just the prettiest witchy purple color. I love how it pops against the black cauldron. I will put a plant in anything. So when I saw this cauldron, I knew I needed it. I knew I was going to put a plant in it and I absolutely love how it came out. They have so many different style cauldrons as well as so many other ritual tools similar to Hex and they are all absolutely stunning. I am so in love with this piece. I look at it every single day. It sits on our living room table and 
I just feel so witchy and happy and I feel the good Salem energy and I love this. Coven's Cottage has a lengthy list of products, so if you're looking for something like this or other witchy items, check them out. They have so much. Like I said, every business shipped super quickly. Everything got here in great condition, and I'm so happy with this. I love it so much. Really quick, before we move on to some crystals, I just wanted to remind you to hit that subscribe button if you're enjoying this video. If you're a new subscriber, leave a comment and let me know after you hit that subscribe button so that I can say hi and we can connect. I love talking to all of you and getting to know you. It means so much to me when you leave a comment and you share your thoughts and ideas with me because I've said it a million times, I want this to be an open space for us to feel like we're hanging out with friends. So chat with each other, chat with me in the comments. Let's get to know each other and let's form a little spooky corner of the internet. I'm also on Instagram and TikTok with the same handle if you wanna connect over there. I post a little bit every day on those accounts, but I am finding that YouTube is my love. I wish I did this sooner. I am having an absolute blast filming and editing and creating thumbnails. I'm having so much fun. My only regret is that I didn't do this sooner. Thank you to those of you who believe in me and support and watch and comment. I appreciate you so, so much. And I'm just so thankful that Spooktube, if you will, has connected us and brought us together. So thank you for your support. Okay, so let's talk crystals. If you follow me on Instagram, you know that I rave about Ascend in Salem. It is this breathtaking crystal shop. I'll insert a photo of what it looks like. When you walk in there, you just feel good. There's nothing but good vibes around you. Everyone that works there that I have met has been so kind and amazing, and I want to give a huge shout out to Carmelo. Carmelo is the owner of Ascend, and there was an item that I was interested in that I had seen on my friend Erin's Instagram that was not listed on the website. So I sent a DM to Ascend on Instagram, and Carmelo reached out to me. We got in touch via phone, and he was able to get me that item. If it gets here before this video goes out, I'm going to insert some photos maybe a video clip. It is a Halloween tarot deck. Now I am new to tarot. I have a very basic old deck, kind of, it's, it's almost like tarot for dummies. Very basic, simple language, but it makes me feel grounded and connected to myself and connected to my goals and aligned with everything that I'm trying to achieve. And so when I saw this Halloween deck, I was like, yes, I need that because you combine tarot with Halloween, and it is just the kind of spooky goodness that I need. Now, I'm in no place to be giving advice about how to read tarot or use your tarot cards. There are many more YouTubers and probably many more websites where you can find information on that, but I'm so excited for this deck to get here. It looks absolutely beautiful, and I appreciate Carmelo so much for helping me still get my hands on it, even though I couldn't go to Salem, so thank you, Carmelo. And leave a comment. Do you use tarot cards? Have you had your cards read? Are you a beginner? Are you advanced? What do you use them for? Any tips? Let me know. There is a motorized mini bike that keeps going by and it's, it's actually nice out. It's a little bit cloudy, but the window is cracked. So if you hear the motorbike, I apologize. I'm sure you hear the birds, but we're gonna go with the springtime ambience because I feel like you're cozy souls like me. You like nature, you like embracing the season. So listen to the birds. Unfortunately, that comes with the sound of the mini bike, but what are you gonna do? So I have a lot of crystals in my house and I wanted to add some more. I love ordering crystals from Ascend because I know where they're coming from. And I know that they're coming from a place full of good vibes and good people and I feel good about what I'm purchasing from them. So I ordered this point. This is Green Aventurine and look at how beautiful she is. I mean, absolutely stunning. Carmelo actually sent me photos of a couple options and I picked out this one because I loved the color on it. I thought it was absolutely gorgeous. So Green Aventurine is said to help your self-confidence, your optimism, and your motivation, which I love. I'm a busy girl and I feel like at times I just wanna crash and it is so easy to lose motivation and lose focus. So I love having this energy in my space to just keep me going and to help me stay positive and confident in myself and my decisions. And so I'm very happy to add this one to my collection. Okay, next up is such a cute little crystal. I'm sure by now you've all seen our German Shepherd Kodo in our videos. I love him so much. He is just my baby. And when I saw this little dog bone crystal, I was like, yes, we need to have this. And it comes in several different stones. So I ordered the red jasper after doing a little bit of research because red jasper is said to help with anxiety, which Kodo gets very anxious when we leave. 
and so I don't want him feeling overwhelmed and anxious. It makes me feel good to know that there's some calming energy when we're at work during the day. It's also supposed to help with things like inflammation and just overall balance your energy. So all the good vibes and good energy for my pup. Like I said, they have this in several other stones, so whatever you're looking for, but I love the idea of having some protection and good energy for our furry friends as well. I think that is so amazing. I love this so much. It's so cute and dainty and I adore it. The next crystal I ordered is this super sweet, super adorable little Dolly Jasper ghost and I think I'm saying that correctly. Look at how beautiful and how cute. Look at the detail. Look at his little face. There's even detail on the hat, the witch's hat. It is such a vibe and I love having this in my house at all times because it's that little touch of spooky without being overwhelming and this crystal is supposed to bring peace into your life and your space which we can all use a little bit more of that in this crazy chaotic world that we're living in. We can all use a little bit more tranquility and I love if my tranquility can come in the shape of a super cute ghost because that is such a mood and I just love him so much. He sits on my little tiny shelf in my living room and I just love him peeking out there. I think he's so beautiful. And again, I am so impressed with how everything got here. Everything was wrapped really carefully. Nothing shattered, nothing broke. I love him so much. Next up is a little crystal that Carmelo threw in my order for me. And it's this little green angel. She's so cute and so sweet. And I'm always going to think of Carmelo when I see this because Carmelo is my Salem angel. When we talked on the phone about placing my order, he was just so sweet. He checked in to make sure I was feeling okay. We chatted about the earthquake, which happened in New Jersey that week. Let me know if you felt that. It was crazy. We totally felt it. The dishes started shaking. It felt like a plane was going over our house. But then when things really started to rattle, I realized what was happening. I was like, oh, we're having an earthquake. It was over in a couple seconds, but... I just appreciate when business owners really care about their clients and they ask how you're doing and they take time out of their day to make conversation with you. It just adds a nice little touch because I feel like we don't get that a lot in everyday life. And so I really appreciate Carmelo going out of his way for everything and including this little angel. Carmelo, you're an angel. I appreciate you. This is gonna sit right on my mantle with all of my other crystals and she is just a perfect piece and she has such a special meaning to me now. And now for the star of the show. Ascend released these the week that I was going to place my order and I saw a preview and I saw Disco Ball and I was like, I gotta wait for this one because I know I'm gonna want it. So I got this beautiful Disco Ball Sun Catcher, which I'm absolutely in love with. If you're new here, I love disco balls. I have them all around my house. I have a mushroom disco ball on our new bar. I have a disco ball planter. I keep little disco balls on my table. I actually have a, let me see if I can get close, a disco ball tattoo, and this is from EMC Tattoos. She's local to New Jersey. She recently moved to Nashville, but she does really fine, beautiful tattoos, and so she added this shell because I do live by the beach, and you know me, I love my mermaid vibes. And she put a little disco ball inside for me and it is just so beautiful. The shading and the detail on it is absolutely stunning. I'm so thankful to her for coming up with this special design for me and I appreciate it so much. So if you're in the area or you're in Nashville and you're looking for someone to do your tattoos, check her out. Or if you're just someone that appreciates tattoos and admires amazing artwork, also check her out because she is so talented. I'm new to the tattoo world. I only have two and they are both from her, but I love seeing everything she creates on her Instagram. It is absolutely beautiful and stunning and she is so talented. Back to our sun catcher. It has obviously this disco ball in the middle, this little tiny cage around it, which just adds a special touch and a moon. So it is almost reminding me of the planets and the solar system, which if you're a nerd like me, you love things like the moon and the sun and the planets and all that. What did we think of the eclipse? Let me know. I personally thought it was going to be more exciting. I was a little bit underwhelmed, but it was still exciting to think of new beginnings and letting go of any bad energy. But yeah, let me know what your thoughts on the eclipse were. Anyway, here she is. She's absolutely gorgeous. Then she comes with all these beautiful silver and clear beads. We have two little crystals on the bottom which catch the light so perfectly. And a couple at the top. It comes with a hook as well so you can hang it anywhere. You can hang it from your ceiling. I currently hang it by our front door and it is 
just so beautiful. Now these are made to order. They were not on the website, so I had to send a DM to order this. This is the second sun catcher that I've ordered from them. I have the Halloween one that hangs above my vanity, and both times everything came wrapped beautifully. Nothing was tangled because there are a lot of different little strings going on. Nothing was tangled, nothing was damaged. She's just a gem. She is so beautiful. I'm absolutely in love. This is going to stay up in my house at all times and bring that disco ball positive energy that we love. I don't know if you could see it now, but it's actually reflecting a little bit. It's not very sunny out, but it is doing a little reflecting for a tiny little disco ball. That's really cool. So yes, by far my favorite piece that I got this time around. So that wraps up our Salem haul for this trip, if you will. I'm hoping to go back in the summer. I will do another haul then, but I love everything I got. I love these Salem owned businesses. I hope that if you're in the market for any witchy, spooky Salem type things, you will check them out. I think it is so important to support businesses that create products with good intentions. And I know that everything I got from Salem was made with good intentions and is going to bring so much happiness and joy to my home. I love that little touch of Salem. I can't wait to go back. And again, I'm so thankful to these businesses for getting everything here so quickly. Don't forget to leave a comment letting me know what your favorite item was. Again, I will be linking all of the shops in the description box. So check them out if you're interested in ordering any of these items. And if you do, let me know. I would love to know what your favorites are and what you decided to order. Thank you so much for watching. I love you and appreciate you all so much. And until next time, stay spooky and stay witchy.